So there's a number of people who were credited or not credited, like Sarah Good, you know, yes. who, who came up, who was recognized as the fourth um, African American black woman to be granted a U.S. patent. You know, and we talked about that last week. But she was from Chicago, and she created the folding uh, cabinet bed. You know, so yeah. that's where the design of the Murphy beds and all of them kind of, you know, kind of thrive from, and it yes. improved on that design because she knew that there was a lack of space in apartments and everything what? that was in the black communities. Mm -hmm. You know, so and that was back in eighteen, um, eighteen eighty five. Well, would uh, what's the name be considered that? A woman in STEM, uh, ah, what's the sister name? I hate that I forgot her name. Oh man, that invented the iron comb. Uh, oh, oh, straight oh, oh. Sarah Boone. Yeah, yeah. Would she be considered that? Yeah, because with, uh, I mean, the ironing board and yeah. everything. Yeah, you know? yeah. I mean that. That's. I mean that's. Uh, you know, when we talk about because they were doing the work, because they were doing the work, they tried to make their jobs a lot easier and more effective and efficient. You know, they saw a problem, they looked to solve it. That's what, you know, that that's what these inventors and, you know, uh, technology innovators do. Yeah. Know? So being able to kind of just tap into that, you know, and uh, understand that. So, I mean, those are some of the trailblazers who, uh, from the past, but, you know, like we want to kind of get more into the modern individuals who are kind of setting and making waves within mm -hmm. the STEM and STEAM fields, you know, one uh, who took it upon herself to develop an organization uh, is Kimberly Bryant, who uh, developed Black Girls Code.